I've um, hurt my back falling over and it really hurt my back so I'm taking it easy for a minute so what I'm doing <coughs> is I'm just on my doorstep taking some shots from here I'll spin you around and show you why this is my view mountains and then up there if I zoom in in the background there there's uh, snow-capped mountains surrounded by mist and um, it looks amazing so what I've got is I'm zoomed in to 200 millimeters and uh, if you can see that that's the composition I've got and it looks amazing on the back of the camera Here's the image. Now spun the camera around, pointing in this direction where this mountain peak is covered by fog and uh, let me zoom this in this is what we've this is what we're looking at really really um, atmospheric contrasty shot In the conservatory now. Just taking some shots out the window because uh, it looks amazing. Just look at this coming down the valley, up the valley, sorry. from the conservatory window. That's a shot right there. That's a shot there with the peaks of a mountain coming out the fog. Welcome to Point de Spain in the French Pyrenees. Amazing place. Let's go and have a little look round and uh, 
see what we can find. Found this composition here with the river running through the straight through the foreground from where I'm standing and you've got the pine trees going up in front and then the mountains in the background a bit of cloud in the sky above so I'm gonna get the camera out set up and take practically this shot that you can see here in uh, in the video I've got a camera set up here to take this and I'm uh, having to focus stack it I'm zoomed in to 70 mil which is roughly a bit further in than that maybe about there and I'm at f11 and uh, 40th of a second ISO 64 I reckon it's probably going to be black and white and um, this is the image come to this massive waterfall where there's ice and uh, uh, you know icicles hanging down from the um, side of the waterfall with the water cascading down the rock there I'm zoomed in to 200 mil uh, let me see if I can show you this if I turn that up a bit There you go, zoomed right in. So I've just got the waterfall and the icicles. I'm at a tenth of a second with a polarizer on, and this is the shot. Amazing. I don't know if you can hear me over the water noise, but that is an amazing cascade. I'm going to get my camera out and see if I can get a shot from here. I've taken quite a few shots of this uh, square crop and um, full frame in portrait mode. I've also zoomed right in on, where are we? This little bit here where you've got some ice hanging down, some water coming out of the rock, right down the middle of a portrait shot with the water cascading behind and the dark rock with the uh, luminosity in parts reflecting off of it. That's quite a nice shot, I think. Generally, this little area is very good. I don't know if you can hear me on this video because of the noise and the wind, but amazing waterfall. Hopefully there's some uh, good shots out of it. And if so, here they are. I really love this snow and these patterns in the snow where it started to melt a bit with this waterfall behind it. 
so I've got the camera in portrait with the polarizer on and I'm going to try and line it up and uh, make a composition out of it when I have I'll, I'll get back to you so I've got this lined up and if you can see that very well where the hang on the waterfalls in the top with this big boulder and these few trees and a bit of sky at the top and then this diagonal of snow that comes round here and then back round here with this snow and these holes in it just got to get the shutter speed right for the water and then I might move round a bit and see if there's another shot as well but looks pretty good from here here's the shot <laughs> 